Hey, hey, everybody. Norzaneda here, and I'm back again with another video. So first and foremost, it's Vlogmas. Happy December. So I'm going to be posting a video a day um, starting the 1st of December all the way up until give love on Christmas Day. Christmas Day. And I am excited about the consistency and the chance to really get to bond with you all, getting to know you, getting to know all about you. So we can get to know each other. You can learn my little idiosyncrasies and I can learn about you and we can build a family and enjoy the holiday season, the Christmas season together. Um, So in today's video, my first video, I'm doing a really low key, simple um, makeup look as you see here. Um, something that you can do, you know, work from home for a Zoom meeting or, you know, going to the store or, you know, maybe hanging out, but you just don't, you know, something low key. You're not trying to go above and beyond, but still show up and glam it up. So this is like a low budget, neutral, glam, affordable look. Corporate approved, work from home approved, Zoom approved. And I'm going to be showing you all everything in the video. But before we hop into this makeup tutorial, I have a goal. I have a goal of a thousand subscribers and 4,000 watch hours. So YouTube recognizes this chat, this channel that I have here is valid and broadcasts me out to a larger audience. I need you to help me let YouTube know that my content is worthwhile. So you can do that by liking, subscribing, clicking the bell shaped icon so you can be notified as soon as I release new hot content, commenting, watching all my other videos, watching this video in entirety, and sharing this video with a friend. So without further ado, we'll go ahead and hop into this video and I'll see you all on the other side. Stay tuned. So I'm taking Jordana Shape and Tape Retractable Brow Pen in the color 05 Brunette. Has a spoolie and it's a little pen. And I am brushing my brows up. I'm so excited to be participating in Vlogmas this year. This is my first Vlogmas. Um, I was on YouTube last year, but I just didn't get the concept of Vlogmas and I didn't post like I was supposed to. So I'm gonna have videos for you all every day from the 1st to the 25th of December. So all Nora, all the time, all access. This is better than Love Island and Big Brother. And as you see, y'all, my hair, R.I.P. So my hair, I got it flat ironed, blow dried, wash, blow dried, and flat ironed like two weeks ago. And this past Sunday, not the one that passed, but the one, the, the one before, we had a deliverance service at church. And my hair sweated out in the back. Like the front stayed, but the back of my hair is ridiculous. It sweated out so bad. It's very Negro. And I'm like, Lord, why me? Why me? My hair was only nice for a week. So, excuse the fluff. That's what it is. So, I've brushed my brows. Uh, this is going to be hard for me trying to line my brows, carve them out on... um camera as opposed to my mirror here so you take I've had a few people ask me about my beauty routine so this is a cute little look that you can do for work um every day zoom appropriate something you could do light for church um hold on mom can you close the door I can hear you dialing on camera Sorry, y'all. I can hear her on the phone. I'm like, hey, I'm trying to record. But this is an easy look that you can do. 
Um, I had someone ask me, they said, we don't, I don't really know what products to use. I don't know, you know, what the products are. Can you tell me? So, um, you use brow pens to... She really is going to talk my entire video. So quarantine struggles. Okay, y'all, so I don't know what else to do. She's just gonna have a conversation while I'm talking to y'all. So everyone, my mom, my mom in the back, everyone. Jesus, she really is going to have this conversation while I am doing my video. How rude. How rude. I might go to the bathroom. She's like, no, I'm going to have this conversation right now. Do, 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 do. I'm really looking forward to Vlogmas. I know my brows are like, oh, that's like really big. But I'm um, trying to give them some shape and we're gonna clean them up with concealer. So I'm taking um, my brush again and brushing out. I, I spend more time on my brows than I do anything because I feel like if you don't do the brows right, they can destroy your entire look. Like the whole look goes to heck in a handbasket. Let me see. The closer I get to you, I'm going to... Oh, I'm taking Kiss New York Professional Top Brow Eyebrow Marker in the color brown. And as you see, a lot of the products I'm using are affordable. Um, I've been on a budget. So this blog, this vlog, this space is about my journey to womanhood, me building the life that I want to build and live, me building and going after my glam life. As you see, the fluff in the back, that pillow, the flowers. I'm all about glam and I want to live my glam life. So to do that, you know, I have to build my empire and the empire includes this YouTube platform, my blog, my Instagram. Um, I'm actually in a real estate course. Um, I am going to be discussing my desire to break up with corporate America um, further in my um, Vlogmas videos. I'm going to have an actual video, probably the one after this, where I talk about how I want to break up. Break up with the girlfriend. More like break up with my job. I'm in a real estate course, and I am so excited about selling homes and making my own money and being my own boss building my own empire and finding ways to work outside of corporate America. Um, but while I'm in corporate America, I still have to play the game. Um, so I want to look appropriate on my Zoom meetings, but this is something you can do for the holidays and something that you can do at any point in time. It's a nice look. Normally my hair is pulled back. I don't like to do the makeup with my hair out, but it's the end of the day and I still brush.
Now I want to try the Dip Brow by Anastasia and Benefits on my brow. Um, so those are two items that I have on my wish list um, that I'd like to try. I'm going to take my Real Technique brush. This is actually a pointed foundation brush and I use it for my brows. It's your thing, do what you wanna do, baby. And that's exactly what I'm doing. Comment below and let me know what you all would like to see from me um, during Vlogmas. I've got some videos coming your way just so getting to know you, getting to know all about you. You can get to know about me. I can get to know about you. And we can end a relationship together. We are family. Clearly, I sing and pull from movie references a lot. So if y'all don't like dream girls, you need to exit stage left immediately because there's no disrespect for dream girls in the mist tea, okay? I also use brow stylus definer from L'Oreal. I use it as well. I play around. I'm out of it right now. Um, but that's another thing that I use on my brow. Now, I... Do my brows, I conceal my brows. There's two different concealers that I typically use and it depends. Here's my makeup bag, by the way, so y'all can see. I got this cute little baby at Wally World on sale one day. But there's two concealers that I go between and it's the Milani um, Conceal and Perfect Longwear in the color 155 Cool Sands. And it is the e.l.f. Hydrating Camo Concealer Satin Finish in the color Deep Cinnamon. Now, I am deep toned. As I know this light is making me look a little yellow, I guess. I don't know. My skin has places where I've got hyperpigmentation and then yellow and I'm brown. So it's kind of hard for me to find the appropriate shade, but here's my brow. And I, depending on how dramatic I want the look to be, I'll conceal and highlight with um, the Conceal and Perfect. But more recently, I've been concealing my brows with the e.l.f. Hydrating Camo Concealer Satin Finish. This was like eight bucks or something. Both of them were both under 10 bucks. Um, a lot of my brow pens were $7 or less. So right now, as I said, I'm building my empire luxury on a budget to luxury. Um, I want y'all to recognize that you can style and profile without spending your whole check. And if you know what to do, you can make anything look good. Mom, mom, she didn't hear dropping names and stuff, girl. I'm out of tone. I'm trying to do a video. Okay, so I just sprayed my Wet n Wild Photo Focus Matte Finish Setting Spray. And I don't know if y'all watch Jackie, 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 but Jackie Aina does this where she'll spray each step. And I do that as well. I like to do that just because it really keeps that step in place. Like whatever you've done there in place. And I wet um, my brush too so that it helps, my, it helps my concealer to blend a little bit better. Jehovah Jireh. Trying to sing some things because she is spilling the tea in the background of my video and I'm already recording. So YOLO. Trisha girl knew I was going in here to record this video for y'all. It be your own mom. It be your own family, y'all. Look how smooth that is and creamy. Mm. 
Now, sometimes people take a darker shade of concealer for the top brow. Excuse my nails. I'm going to get them done at some point. Um, but anyway. I've been working on the railroad all the live long day. I'm trying to sing as she drops names so that I can... I'm not deleting this video. So if you want to be a petty patty in the background, ma'am, be a chitty chatty patty, but I'm not deleting this video. Now I gave you sound warning. I You didn't warn your family. They still get in there and show up. So there's me blending. Just to pass the time away. Ah. Oh. Mom, mom, shut up. Speaking about, you know, I told y'all about my real estate course. I've got so much to get done before December the 31st. So I'm going to have to take some days off of work so that I can work through my course. Because my thing is, I need to be able to make money outside of corporate America. I'm so tired of corporate America. I'm getting tired of this. I'm trying to tell you all. I'm trying to get off the corporate plantation. And I've always had this love for real estate and like finding. I love sales and I like finding the right fit and match. Um, I love home decor. Uh, more recently, since I've gotten out of college in 2014, I've been in corporate recruiting um, and I've done some um, industrial staffing, temp staffing, but more recently corporate recruiting and um, clinical recruiting. But I'm at a place where I just cannot do corporate anymore. And I'm like, you know what? I like real estate. You can make good money in real estate. Let me start doing some things that I can own my own time and my own schedule. So here's how it looks so far. I already look more alert. Ah, ma'am, God almighty. People going family members gonna watch this video and be like, I'm just saying, PSA, I tried to tell her to zip it so I can record this video. Let me know what you all have going on for the holidays, like for Christmas. What do you have going on for Christmas? What are your plans? How are your families doing? How are you faring during the quarantine? Um, I know it's kind of hard to look forward to things like during the holiday season when you're supposed to be isolated and everything. But I still feel like this past Thanksgiving has probably been the best Thanksgiving that I've had in a while. So I know a lot of you probably if you're watching my videos last year around this time are where, you know, my parents divorced or are going through a separation and divorce. And that was really the first holiday right after we found out about some things that went on and the uh, I guess the dissolution, the dissolving, the breakdown of the family. There was a lot of hurt and anger and confusion there in the last season. But to be on the other side of that is just an amazing feeling. It's an amazing feeling to still be standing here and able to smile and record videos and go on about my life. Um, so I have... I'm going to do, I like to do my shadow, shadow beneath thy heaven. I'm going to be pulling out this, um, it's my Ray Ray palette from a BH Cosmetic. This is the first volume of that palette. And trying to decide what I want to do with my eyes or if I want to do anything with my eyes. Um, hmm. Sometimes I just 
take concealer and then some powder and pat it over and just do a regular eye. And I think that's what I'm going to do just for easy work look. You know, you're not trying to, pardon me, I'm not trying to like go crazy for work. So what I'm going to do is, 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 um, well, I just had my spray. I don't know. Oh, here it is. Normally, I have my hair in a bonnet, so be careful. <laughs> don't want to wet your hair anymore. So, I've sprayed my hair again. My hair. Oh, my God. <laughs> I sprayed my face again with my matte finish, Wet n' Wild setting spray. And I'm coming to follow up with my Photo Focus Wet n' Wild matte finish primer. Now, I do want to let you all know that about two hours ago, two, three hours ago, I put the Olay Deep Hydrating Serum with Hydrolauronic Acid. I put a few squirts of it on my face because I wasn't planning to do makeup, and that was just going to be it. But now, I think it's good, especially with me having oily skin, putting things on top that'll help um, provide some hydration to my skin so that my makeup looks good and the oil isn't fighting to get through it um also i need to work on drinking more water i would say drink more water because drinking more water helps you with the oil it hydrates you from the inside you can do everything in the world on the outside but if you're not eating right and i'm learning as you can see stress breakouts i ate a lot of crazy food and sweets um for thanksgiving and you can see that i'm breaking out lord whatever you're doing this season if y'all like me to do a Christmas carol video, let me know. I get nervous singing um, in front of people, but I'm nervous singing right now because my mom's in the background running her lips. So now, I'm going to take the CoverGirl True Blend Matte Made Foundation in the color Toasted Almond D60. Got makeup under my nails here, y'all. Sorry. D60. And I'm going to... And then I'm going to take my brush. So I got this cute brush set from Walmart and it was 50% off. I think it was like $4.99 after the Christmas season, last season. And I'm gonna take my setting spray. This helps your foundation lay nicely. So I'm the kind of girl that does my brows first. I've seen other people do their brows afterwards and I've done my brows afterwards, but it doesn't, I don't know. I feel better about my concealer blending when I do it before my foundation. And I make sure that there's a little bit of concealer above the brow, but not a lot so that it doesn't look like noticeable 
So you could just do something like this, bare basic if you wanted to, low effort, but I'm gonna take it a step farther and I'm going to take, I dropped it. My Milani Conceal and Perfect and I'm going to I love a dramatic highlight, no matter how basic the mood is. I love the dramatic highlight, I love it. Taking my brush again, spray, and then I'm going to Yeah, 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 mom, not anyway, hush, hush. So this is my highlight. Well, anyway, I um <laughs> trying to talk over her, y'all. I'm so sorry. Um I'm very excited about Vlogmas, Vlogmas. I'm very excited about some of the changes that are happening right now. I'm excited about really building my empire, getting this real estate course done, taking my exam, transitioning out of corporate America, and really just kind of figuring out how to do other things. I don't know if it's public speaking. I want to be more involved in my church. I want to be more involved, you know, in my community. And I want to be involved in a way where I'm not constrained and confined by corporate America. Um, I'm really excited about this season. And I'm going to tell you all something that I did that was pretty life-changing recently um, in another video. So if you want to hear more about me breaking up with corporate America, drop a comment below. Um, I highlighted... And now I'm going to take a brush. So this is my brush, the BH Cosmetic Quarty Crystal Collection. I'm taking the brush and the number one. And I'm taking, this is a um, Always Spicy Blush from e.l.f. It was like six bucks. I'm taking it. And yay, don't listen, <laughs> mom. Mom won't let you be great sometimes. Lord have mercy. I'm over here trying to be great for Vlogmas and entertain y'all. She won't let me. Okay, so I took Always Spicy and I used it as a contour. I'm not gonna really contour my forehead today just cause it's light. And this is something like if you're gonna wear it to work or church, something light, you're not trying to go crazy. I don't wanna do like anything too extra. I am going to take my, it's my Ray Ray palette. And there's a um, a contour color powder called Brownie Bite right here. Two smacks. And just kind of getting my cheek. Get in my cheek. Get in my cheek. Get in my cheek. Get in my cheek, y'all. Just to kind of darken it up a little bit. So 
see that definition? Now, I don't highlight or contour my nose just because my nose is already small and it's ethnic the way it is. My nose is my nose and I'm not trying to make my nose anything other than what it is. Now, power to the girls that can contour their nose to the heavens. I'm just not about it. That's just not who I am. You're not going to see me contouring my nose. You won't. I just don't. I don't. Dang, she's really still dropping names. Oh, my God. Y'all better not watch this video just to get teeth from my mom. Watch this video for the cool makeup tips. So, now I'm going in with blush. Now, y'all need to learn your facial shape and the structure because you need to build your contour and your highlight based on your facial shape. So, my, th my shape is um, oval. See? So, I highlight at points to complement and contour at points that complement and add. Now, you see, you already see a natural highlight here now. Like, the light is attracted to certain points of my face. You can really see my cheekbone in here a little bit more. Like, I already have naturally high cheekbones, but you can just really see it now. Um... You contour and highlight for a way that matches your face. Now, I'm going in with the True Blend So Flushed High Pigment Blush from CoverGirl in the color 345 Hot Frenzy. And I just want a little color. Normally, I'm using my Juvia's Palace uh, place. I like to say palace, but it's probably place. Anyway, ma'am, and I, oh my God, now you hear her talking about me trying to do a video. She didn't talk the whole video. So you may leave this blush off. You could have just done what I did with the um, Always Spicy and left it there. Um... And then what I'm going to do now, my lips are a little dry. Now I use the LA Color Girl Eyeliner and I use this three or four different eyeliner colors that I use. This is Deepest Brown. For some reason I use the eyeliners for lip liners. I didn't realize they were eyeliners. And at this point I've already used them for lip liners. So that's what they are. But they were like $1.99 from the hair store. Now I would say I need to do a lip scrub this winter season. I may do like a self-care video for y'all, um, exfoliating the body and the lips and getting them winter ready because my lips are a little dry, but I'm going to outline. So this would be a pretty ombre if I did like a pink or something right now. But I'm going to do this red. So I'm in love with the Revlon. Um, what are these called? Revlon Super Luster Lustrous. The Gloss. This is Fatal Apple. But um, I also have um, Sugar Violet that I use, which would be pretty for the holiday. Um, I was thinking about giving you all a Milani red lip, but I don't feel like doing red lip today. But this color is pretty. And then... Anyway, Trisha girl won't let me be great, y'all. I'm so thrown off because she's in the background. I'm so sorry, y'all. This 
this, this line is one of my favorites. Like, I probably use these lip glosses every day. And they're all under 10 bucks. So this is a look, you can leave it this way. And that's appropriate for a zoom, but just a little pizzazz. Now, if I really wanted to be extra, I would add my Milani highlighter, but that would just be like, I'm gonna stun on you all on this Zoom or WebEx. Like, can't touch this. You know what I mean? That would really be over the top for work. Um, like a, a work night event would be fine. Oh, I forgot to highlight y'all. Hold on. So I use the Fit Me Loose Finishing Powder from Maybelline in the color Light Medium. I'm going to try Medium Deep, but... Um, the one that I go to, they were out. And I just take my brush from Real Techniques. It just gives you a, a layer of pow pow. Look at my eyes. Whoa. Whoa. Just a little, just a little, just a little, just a little. Normally I put this on right after I conceal and before I put on my contour and blush and everything, but I was in a mood today, I did it last. So here's a look. And then if I really, want to do something, I would take like this color finishing powder, loose setting powder that I have from Black Radiance and just put it on my eye so that it didn't look as, I guess, glossy or, you know, the kind of that glare that concealer gives, but I ain't gonna do it. Now, finally, my Black Radiance um, Fine Liquid Liner. I'm going to use it. I love the open look. Like, it's fresh. Fresh face, but still... You know, still appropriate. In the Lord. In the Lord, my soul's been anchored in the Lord. Oh, Ooh. and just a little on the corner liner, just to give some definition to the eye. Be careful about blinking your eye when the liquid is drying because that liquid can get all over your lid. And if you have um, shadows on, it can mess up your shadow look. So really be careful when you're putting on. And also let it completely dry before, if you want to set your face finally, let it completely dry before you do that because you'll have eyeliner everywhere if you don't. Someone please call 911. Tell them I just end up in my and it's pierced me through my soul. Feel my body getting cold. Whoa. Sometimes I feel like I'm a prisoner. That was my Wyclef Jean. 
impression <laughs> trapped in here, here for a while. It's a heart of these four walls. I want to break. Now I'm using um, the Bambi Eye Mascara from L'Oreal. I love that it has this pretty like mirror so you can see how you're putting on your liner that's how the brush looks my mama gotta love her i be telling her to hush sometimes but she does not listen to me she does not. And I'm not deleting this video. So you had your chance, ma'am. You had your chance. You blew it. I be telling my mom about that chaotic spirit, like hush, hush, hush. And oh, that's another thing I'm going to tell you. This is a nice look here, a nice Zoom appropriate look, work look every day, something chill, but to let them know I'm still here. I'm still glam. I'm still me. I'm still diva. You know what I mean? Just a little something, a little something. But what I want to tell you all in this season I know we want to, you know, have festivities and enjoy socially distance or not, preferably socially distance, but we're going to be, we're in a season still where Jesus is the reason of the season and the, the season is about light and joy and hope and love. Be careful in this season that you're not entangling yourself with spirits that are not, you know, the kind of spirit you want to be entangled with um, and be careful do some introspection. I want to talk about in our upcoming series in my vlogmas. I'm going to talk about, you know, managing the holiday season. You're going to be interacting with people. And one thing, one part of that is making sure that your house is in order and that you aren't the problem. A lot of the times we talk about what other people do to us, but you have to look and see what you are doing to other people. And I think sometimes the chaotic spirit, being a busybody. Not that I'm dragging her, but I am saying to y'all in this season, be particular about what you're saying to people, what you're discussing, if you're uplifting people, if you're dragging them. That's all I'm saying. Um, and I know everyone has a chisme and their little girl chat and chit chatter and all of that stuff, but make sure that you're saying something uplifting in this season at least in this season something going on in the atmosphere because the last hour and a half the police have been circling not police but the ambulances have been circling Bambi don't go. Okay, y'all. So this is my final, final looks. Final countdown. Y'all see my little hair is nappy from being, from sweating out. <laughs> but yeah, so this is a cute look that you could do. Brown girl approved, brown girl focused, brown girl friendly. But you can use whatever products you have, do what I do, and it'll look good.
All right, everybody. So this is the end of my chaotic first day video. Vlogmas day one. Here's the end of that chaotic video. But thank you all for watching. If you've made it to the end of this video, pat yourself on the back. Let me know what your favorite Christmas movie is. Comment below and let me know what your favorite Christmas movie is. That lets me know that you've watched this entire video, that you've gotten to the end, that you support me that much. And I love y'all and appreciate that. Um, drop some comments below. Let me know what you think of this look. I may do um, a more dramatic holiday look um, um, a couple of videos from now. But comment below. Let, let me know what you want to see from me. Um, for Vlogmas. I've got some videos in store for y'all already. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye. Thanks for watching.